Good evening, everyone. Good evening. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back. We've got our second match that I'm going to be casting coming up very, very shortly. We have in the XP League Division 6 group stage, we have AK Nation versus Blaze Norway. Both of these teams have got an outstanding record so far as the group stages stand. Akimbo Nation currently 3-0 and with only a map record of 9-2. So only lost two maps in their three map uh, three games they've played. And then Blaze Norway, who's sitting second place to them, are 2-0 and in their map record uh, with a 6-2 record as well on their maps so i mean that's going to be it's going to be a quite a nice contest both sides are going to be very strong going forward here and um, it's going to be an interesting matchup for sure this will be kind of taking away the top spot if uh, ak nation win this one they'll kind of be leaps ahead of uh, blaze norway and anybody competing next up to them but so far so it'll be i'm looking forward to it. it's going to be plenty plenty to look forward to guys hopefully you're all there watching along as well and enjoying the 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 game place there's going to be some some epic scenes and epic uh, matches we're going to skip over to see what uh, we will be map rotation will be chosen they have been, uh, they have been selected the vetoes are all in and uh, coming up we're going to see these map rotations you're going to have six star hard point our first matchup of the day followed by a couple of sets of invasion s and d followed by the control and then we're going to go into a real hard point if we get there and then final one if we get to the match five will be a high rise snd so we're seeing a varied uh, invasion control always seems to be uh, one of the most predominantly picked maps for a uh, control i don't know whether that's because they find it uh, difficult uh, <laughs> to uh, think to uh, to take because it's on attack it's very very difficult for the most part so the defenders maybe get that choice preferably and want to try and defend it thinking that might be an easier choice um, but we'll see how that uh, how the pans out, see how these guys are on this lane uh, and obviously the control of the positions and uh, killing out and getting onto that point and uh, out rotating the opposition. Our point six star is another one of these smaller maps, so it's going to be a really quick paced and very on it sort of game. So we're going to be interesting to see how uh, how quickly in all these spots for nades and, and all that coming up. We're going to be just uh, waiting around just to see how we how we get on. Um, obviously, waiting up. The match is supposed to start in eight minutes from now. So, fingers crossed, all goes to plan and we can get into it uh, and get started. And hopefully, we don't have any issues with uh, getting kicked out of the map and stuff like we did on the last stream. Which, uh, there was nothing I can do at that point in time. If the game kicks me out, the game kicks me out and I can't get back in as a caster, which is sad because it just joins me back in as the game. And then makes me want to join the side. And obviously... As the caster, you can't join the side. It gives you an extra advantage <laughs> somewhere. There's no way of physically avoiding that and uh, the round end, and it would give uh, somebody else an advantage unintentionally. Carlos for the carry. Have a good one, lads. Oh, Carlos. Eh? We're going to look out for Carlos. So, AK Nation support is in already. Good to see you guys. Good to see you in chat. So, the uh, roster for tonight for AK Nation will be Desire, Raz. Soma and Kalis. If not, if uh, there might be a, a change of knack depending if uh, how how it goes. I don't know. Nobody's updated me if there is a change there. Sadly, uh, thankfully. So as things stand, it we desire Raz, Soma, and Kalis. And you're obviously seeing Kalis for the carry. So I don't know if that's uh, a friend of yours or he's just uh, in your in your uh, organization as well. And then for Blaze Norway, we have Privacy, Marfian, Breezy SM, and then Sveps. I don't know if it's Sveps or, yeah, it seems like Sveps. Good to see you, Akimbo. Good to see you, Akimbo Org. How are you doing? I hear uh, there might be a few of you guys watching along from your organization, so enjoy. Uh, fingers crossed for you as well, and we'll see how these maps uh, and rotations come up and how you hold and how your favor goes towards uh, Blaze Norway. Obviously, free and old uh, record so far. You want to keep that. You don't want to get rid of that donut there you like the donut because that donut's the best donut when you're not conceding and not getting beat only lost two maps out your full 11 maps played so far so i mean that's a that's a fantastic start 82 percent map wins um as opposed to 75 percent for blaze norway who have also played a map less so or a series less so it it will vary it will change we'll wait and see how uh how this one comes and the blaze norway will want to be trying to make it free and all for them as well 
and potentially give you your first loss on the board. So I'm sure it's going to be a very fought after matchup. We'll jump over to just just my beautiful self just now while we wait for the matchup. I've changed the camera position and it's slightly, slightly too much, but slightly too big. I know it feels so dark because the room is so dark and I always don't want to put any more lights on. So we'll keep the darkness because that's what it's all about. It's that mystery that we're getting to see, the mystery. It's just just of what could happen and what could be. To uh, Mark Ape and uh, Lucy, do you guys both play for AK Nation in one of the other sides? Is there more than one part of that organization, one, more than one team competing in the, in the divisions throughout this uh, league? Or is it, uh, is it just a one team of uh, Akimbo Nation? I've not really seen a second because I'm relatively new to this whole esports side of things um in terms of casting whoop whoop <laughs> um yeah so I'm, I'm relatively new to this i uh, i got introduced by ari so you might some of you might know ari he also casts and uh, is part of uh, helmets um so yeah we're uh, definitely trying to get my head around everything that goes on in it because it's so crazy <laughs> i'm actually able to watch this whole game can't wait oh nice not working or anything like that yeah that's good to hear. <laughs> um, I've got this, and then I've got to go straight into EA Sports Pro Clubs matches. So that's going to be fun. A busy, busy night for me. Um, but I'm really looking forward to this. The casting, I've been doing for a while, but it, for a, a sort of slower pace game. Um, Callis, Akimbo, Phil Louise, thank you for the follows. I do appreciate it. It doesn't come up on any other screen, bar the casting cable and maybe the start and ending scenes because during the matches we don't want it, that notification going off and going mad. Callis is a friend and a workmate. Taught him everything he knows in COD. <laughs> of course he did. That's why he's going to go off and he's going to be the best in the game. I'm going to look for MVPs and it'll be because Mark had taught him everything he knows. <laughs> So I don't know who has to contact me in terms of arranging the matchup. We've got three minutes, so I'm waiting on Knack. Knack was the last person that contacted me in regards to the... Oh, Market D's Bees, thank you for the follow, but I appreciate it. Welcome. Welcome to the Team G. So yeah, we're waiting on inf information for mo uh, the mode and stuff and the, the whole private match joining Malarkey. So I'm still, still relatively new to it. Like I says, it's all new. The whole cast and think i like i watch cod pros all the time like i'm watching them every weekend when there's fun and stuff and watching it through the night and stuff but it's a different story when you're casting trying to keep an eye on what's going on and trying to control who you're viewing because at the point i'm like oh, where am i supposed to be looking who am i supposed to be watching where am i you know it's it's very strange the first time around today it was only two days ago so this is my second stream ever doing it so fingers crossed it all goes well once again like i says we will be I think I know a wee bit more of the controls and the buttons and stuff and bring up all the information. If there's anything you just want to see and you just know how to fix it or how to do it, let me know. Let me know, guys. Don't be scared to say something because um, I would definitely want to improve, obviously, as we go along um, and as the, as the games progress and as my streaming on these kind of casts progress, we do want it to be a, a good show. I want to put on a good show for you all. Um, and know what I'm meant to be and not meant to be doing. I have watched a few of the guys that have posted their streams um, for the the whole XP League, and I've been looking back over some of them and seeing what they do and where they are and what they're speaking about, and you know, like learning a few things here and there just to try and see what I should be doing. Um, so yeah, it's all it's all a learning curve. Once we get there, I'm sure it'll it'll go smoothly. I think the, the most important part is uh, the gameplay and to trying to get as much of the gameplay seen as possible. So depending on who's attacking and defense, I'm going to probably prioritize a certain side depending on where they are on the map and stuff and then we'll, we'll kind of work it from that. So if they're in the if they're in the hard point, I'll watch a few of the boys' POVs that are defending that point while we watch the, the jumping coming in. 
Philly Louise is going to DM you regarding the match. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Will she be able to find my place to message me? <laughs> Whoever's keeping me up to that is perfect. Because I need to look at message requests because I'm sure it'll be there or somebody will add me. There we go. Accept. Perfect. There we go. We, we have a wee... Hello, hello, Louise. There you go. There's a wee hi. I'll give you a wee hi in chat so we know that the conversation has started and we're good to go. I hear my little man crying and I don't know if he's in the room next door or if he is downstairs still with his mum. He is in his room. Crying his heart out. Poor thing. <laughs> So yeah, let's have a look again back over at the series board and what we're going to be seeing match-wise. I'm sure Nick gave me a list of who was starting what map as well. And I'm sure your oppositions are starting, so they'll be... Yeah, yeah, you guys pick. That's fine, perfect. Good to know. But yeah, there we go for your maps, modes, and uh, what's coming up next. Yo, Bob McBaggis. McBaggis? There we go. <laughs> All right, how are you doing? Not sure where Nack is. Okay. Let's see if we can add a few of the things that we had in here as well. So, is it media source? No, it's not. What was the thing I was way to add? Uh, yeah, there we go. Okay, hopefully when the next follower comes in, it doesn't take up too much space there. I've tried to change this alert box somewhere in there, so hopefully it fits and doesn't look stupid, but we'll wait and see. It will cover up somewhere. What time do the games start, Marky? Marky, the games start at half past seven, supposed to be, but we're waiting on information to join the lobby. It's supposed to be half past seven is what I was told anyway, but Nack's not here and... Uh, Louise is the one potentially trying to get the information to pass on so we can join up the match. So it should be starting very, very soonly. The quicker, the better for you guys. So you're not waiting around to listen to me. Just trying to fill time and air so we're not listening to <laughs> just me. So yeah, that's what we're, that's the plan. We'll wait and see. Hopefully, if I can add the thing I was going to add, there'll be a wee bit of background noise, but there we go. It's not there. Okay. Media source. I'm sure it's a media source. There we go. That's the wrong thing. See, see what happens when you add the wrong thing? It looks dumb. I added the wrong thing for a second. Media source. That's the one I was on to add. And we put that right behind the background. Right behind there. There we go. So Marky, is your name Mark as well? And your hence your Twitch name's Marky. 
follows along with him, lean as mine. That's what my wife calls me, Marky. Normally when I'm in, a, in the bad books, to be honest. So probably won't be long when she's shouting at me because I'm waking up the little one. Because all I do is get carried away and start shouting. Because we're hyped. There's just so many people though in this uh I've messaged privacy, hopefully. He uh, he can get this sorted. We'll wait and see as well. Between Louise and uh, privacy, well, fingers crossed we can uh, we can get something <laughs> set up there. You're on your eighth beer already, boy. Oh, Jesus. You've been watching the football, have you? Or it's just, just like, <laughs> just what you wish to do. I still don't have anything in message requests for them, so they've not tried to contact me. Yeah, it's supposed to be, it was supposed to be seven minutes ago. Well, sadly, we're not started yet, and I don't know how long it's going to be because we're still waiting on information. Gallus was in chat, so he, do you know the information? Do you know the code to get into the private match? <laughs> there we go. We have the information needed. Enter. Sorry about this. Sorry about the sound as well. That won't uh, that won't work either. Codcaster visuals. Gameplay show. Where's the? Identity, custom, team sense.
only annoying thing is, is they're very similar colors. So we're going to make a nation. Save. Make sure we're all into that. I need to get moved to Codcaster. We've got There we go, we've got everybody set up. I'm a Pfeiffer and I'm not a Pfeiffer. It's a skill day, fuck's sake. <laughs> Sorry about this guy's knack. It's going to get a firm talk and two when he reappears. <gasps> oh, when he reappears. He's a well-spoken Scotsman, sounds like Seth, actually. Lol. Oh, nah, I'm, uh, I'm Dundonian. It might not sound Dundonian either, to be fair. Pretty, pretty politely spoken for a Dundonian. Ken, what I mean? Close to a five though, close to a five, not far off. I do get told that. Most of the time it's like, are you from Edinburgh? No, I'm not from Edinburgh. F5. That's like, oh, I've got a friend request. Let's make sure I... Where do I get that? Friend request accepted. That would be the easy way to do it. So hopefully I've got all these uh, settings set up the way they need to do. This beautiful screen that we see here is absolutely fantastic. And then hopefully when that gets put me into this, we are all good to go. So we've got all the teams ready. Our first map is going to be six there. I'm ready to go. Chat, everybody in chat is ready to go. Let's, uh, let's see if we're ready to go as well. Cast are ready, cast are ready. Close enough, exactly, yeah, close, close enough. Where's Seth from then? Is he Scotchman as well? Just wait till I've had a few drinks on me and I'm hyped. Then there's... Dundonian comes out then, I think. Team jumping. They're saying in chat here they, they needed to get the jumping jacks in for AK Nation because the uh, brain's not switched on yet. Here we go. So we are good. We are all good here. We're all good on their end. We'll show you the series board again. The correct way to get into straight away. First matchup. Six star. Hard point. Here we go. We're going to have Blaze Norway as the host of their team one, followed and then AK Nation team two. Let's see, hopefully this is all all the way it should be.
There we go. Let's see this. There we go. We're on board with Callus here on the on the hard point straight away. Callus from AK Nation jumps straight on the hard point. We'll watch Raz. Raz in a position. Let's see. Who can round the back? He's got got a couple of pickups here, but it's kind of traded out. Breezy's getting shot out here, but gets oh, unlucky from Raz here. He does get picked up at Callus. Still on the point. Let's look at Suma. Where is he coming back in to look at the support? As Blaze now we break the hard point here and start getting on to the last 30 seconds here. Can they hold on here? Let's look at privacy. Privacy being watched over by Breezy's here. Looking for the other players around. Looking for the flanks. Just to see where we're coming in from here. There you go. Callus gets... Oh, he does beams on Callus with a two-piece. They're on to the point. There we go. Raz going around the flank here. Let's looking for the spot respawners coming in. As the rotation's coming for the new hard point. Like that point two. There we go. Picked off by Sveps. Sveps is nailed in the head. We're going to watch Privacy here, who's on the new hard point. See, his spots as they are, gets out of his life though. You see how they're going to get followed up here. They're very, very similar in type colours, so it's very difficult to tell who's who. But there you go, you've got Raz on the right hand side here. Looking to come in with Desire. Desire pushes individually, gets off the kill. Now are they going to put onto the point? Raz jumps onto the point, here we go. He's inside on the hard point there. It's contested here as he falls to Marfian. Marfian. Is also being traded out though, but privacy getting back into the point, gets under into the vents, slides out, gets the kill, gets a second, does he? Yes, he does. He picks up two here as he grabs the last of the points here on this hard point. Well, still 24 seconds to go here, in a good position here as well as he stands. Let's look at number four here, Sveps. Looking around. Oh, he picks off a good kill there on Callus. Coming around the corner. Laz is sitting in the corner, but he does get picked off from Raz, who is waiting, sitting and waiting. Oh, we'll keep an eye on Raz here, who just picks up the double piece here. Picks off Breezy's. Marfin just picked up from Desire in the back there. Marfin looking around the flank. Raz is repositioning. He's on the new hard point, waiting for that just to tick over as it does. But the, the back man does get picked off. Marfin is picked off. There's two, three people on the hard point here as they start to come in. Here you can see number three trying to fold in. Is he going to jump over that ledge to your right hand side here of Raz? He's looking to this contested. He's in the contest spot. Oh, he has beams him. Marfin beams him from the contest point as Callus comes up to clear that up there. Nice one there from uh, Callus and Sumer getting a couple of pieces on the board here. It's pretty even here as we're coming into the second, uh, the third hard point here. 30 seconds left. Suma on a, a five piece here. We need to sit and watch Suma. Let's see. He's going to get pick up this cruise missile here. If he picks off one, he's almost stunned out there. But the trophy system saves his life there. He's getting a couple of shots off. He does pick up that cruise missile there. That's Suma with the cruise missile now and he's going to go back on the rotation looking to look for the next rotation of hard point here we've got 12 seconds left Callus will keep getting the points there as Suma gets out of his life is he going to get the kill here? no Breezy picks that up watch Breezy follow that through is he going to find any more as he gets towards the hard point his new team are set on the hard point here as it is we've got Sveps on the hard point with Breezy is looking for the spawners and new players rotating down from AK Nation AK Nation does come around the back but his one Callus has picked up but there's a double on the board for AK Nation, Sweeps and Breezy's fall. And there we go, let's look at Raz, it's on the hard point. Just gets shot off up there, but Desire is still here. We've got onto Desire here, see where they are spotting any of the players from Blaze Lobby. Marfin comes around the corner, so the Sweeps is a double challenge and it's perfect. Picks up three on the board there. And we'll look at Sweeps as he is on the hard point. 27 seconds less here on this hard point. Are they going to contest it? Is AK Nation going to push back up? Callus comes down here. Is he going to get stunned? He does get hit by the stun. Sveps knows where he is. Marfin picks off Suma. And they're still on this hard point here. Oh, there we go. Let's look at Six. Six is coming round. Raz. Oh, this gets razzled right in the face with the shots there. Breezy's. Raz is coming off the spot. And let's look at Breezy's who just died there. Marfin actually. We, oh, as soon as we got it, Suma gets the kill. Suma still not used that cruise myself. Still has that to go. Jumping on to the, the hard point, back to P1 here we go in Infinity Pool. Suma has been going off on this game so far. There you go, he spots Privacy, that's a perfect spot, there you go. Oh, he smashed Marfian as well, he gets the two-piece. Suma, ball in here as he sees his steps coming around the corner. Oh, he does get gunned off of the point though. Carlos gets gunned off of the point here as well. Let's look at where Raz is going to the... Oh, he picks up the double, has a triple for Raz as he falls... From Privacy, who picks up that kill. Privacy jumps onto the hard point. Starts to get the last 20 seconds here, but does fall off of this point. Let's look to where the spawners are coming in. You can see AK Nation kind of setting up for the second hard point here. They're fi they're finishing up for that there. But um, Breezy's spots Desire. Can he get... Yeah, he does get the kill on with Desire there. Callus coming from the spawn as well. And he's beamed off of the head glitch there. 
perfect shots from Brazies. Not getting any more points there on the last hard point rotation, but we are into the new rotation. Let's look for Murphy and looking for the second hard point here. As it's just about to pop, it does so now. They are on point, but AK Nation on point. Suma with a couple of good kills there. Let's look at Desire. Desire gets a, gets another there as well. Suma sweeps in the distance, but doesn't get it. AK Nation holding the point here. 20 point lead as it stands. Oh, what a good shot there from Desire. Going to have to jump onto the hard point because nobody's there. Callis coming into support here. Goes for a double. Murphy and gets killed there. Get traded out. He does get the kill on Callis, but then Desire picks up. That trade there, let's look at Kallus now from the spawning point, he's getting some guns on there, gets Sveps, looking for any players coming on the sides here, will we pick off Privacy, Privacy's running back the other way there as you can see, Sveps, oh he beams Sveps with a rival 9 right to the head there, and he's in the new hard point here, it's going to be, oh Privacy spots him, finds him and picks up the kill, is Raz going to get the kill on him, he does, he clears that up as well, so now Two players for AK Nation on the hard point here. A 30 second lead as the contest comes in from Marvin. Marvin with the double. Oh, what a fantastic double there from Marvin as he picks up the, the hard point here. 40 second, six seconds left on this hard point as well. Marvin almost gets a kill on Callus, but he does get beamed as well. It's traded out Callus with the double, but then gets traded out from Brazies, who is on the hard point. AK Nation are going to pick it up. Nope, Brazies. Just gets beamed off of it. Marfian. Oh my god, a couple of kills in the hard point. That's really difficult to keep an eye on here. Suma now grabbing the 28 seconds left. All the respawner for Blaze Norway coming from their spawn. Three of them at the time. There's only one in the back as it stands here. Number one. Just they're spawning quite far out here. So it's a good amount of time here for AK Nation to grab the, the spot. And grab a lot of points. Privacy beams them off of the top though. What a good shot there from Privacy as he's traded out there from Raz. And now we're going to watch where Suma's rotation is going desires on the point still grabbing the last extra points before the rotation of the new and actually we're doing jump over to number four sweps is on the uh, new hard point as it is they're looking at both directions here looking from back and forward through offices you can see on the left of your screen there raz is going to come around he gets he beams sweps raz gets traded out privacy gets a double previous he picks a double up as well and that is four in the feed there for blaze norway Good guns. Brazy's on a 22 and 16 as a cruise missile is being called in here. Where is that cruise missile coming in? It doesn't pick a kill up actually. It's surprising. Privacy, good shots there on Raz. Spot. Here's the shots from Callas as well. Callas sends in the nays as you can see there, but they're tramping. Double piece for Murphy and Osuma and Desire picked off. It's 198. It's closing that gap here. We've got 15 seconds less of this hard point. It's going to make them go in front if they can hold us for this whole time here. And it will be a new rotation to P1 for AK Nation. It looks like they're looking to set up. But number four is already there. Sveps picks up one. Callis is on the corner. He's got two players coming in. And he gets beamed here from Suma. Suma then gets traded out. Let's go see where Raz is going. Callis gets onto the point. They're, they're com contesting this many, many points with five points difference. Callis beamed off of him. Breezy's on a double again. Once again, Breezy's showing how it's done here. Let's see where Breezy's is going to go here from here. Just got killed off their streak though. Wasn't too much, but Suma's on the point there. Callas jumps in, gets traded, he gets shot out from Marfian. Trophy system doing its what, what job there. A couple in the feed there for AK Nation, but Privacy gets traded out. Suma also falls to Sveps. Let's look at Privacy. Oh, he just gets the kill on Callas as we just take a view. Sends out the stun. Good position there. He's known the players are going to rotate on there. Is Privacy going to spot the player in the back though? Number six. Oh, he doesn't. Number six gets the kill there. Raz going round. Callas picks off Brazies. Now they're looking to the rotation of the new hard point here. And five is already on it. Callas already on. Desire watching the back. He's going to watch that. That's a good wee jump out. Murphy knows that they're going to be waiting. He's waiting for his teammate to come and combine with him. He sends in the nade. Nade not good. Marfin's in the corner, Callas reads it, goes round, takes him out of the game, looking for the player in the back, it is traded out there, Sweps getting a double though, oh, Brazy's guns Callas, and Brazy's takes a point, hard point, there we go, we are pretty much neck and neck here by the time these get these points on here, but a couple of good shots from Brazy's, and now they are taking a 20 point lead here, killing spree here for Sweps, let's look on the on board with Sweps, is he going to get this cruise missile bricked off, yes he does, he picks up the cruise missile as we join there, Killing off. Oh, Marvin, but Suma kicks up Sweps and Suma will take the last of these points here, will they? No, they won't. Looks like the hard point is still in favour of Privacy and his squad. And that's a couple of great shots there, Privacy. Sweps trading out. 
It's another full push though for Making Nation, surprisingly considering the hard point there, but it needed to be done and please Norway take the win. What a matchup that was, that was such a back and forward, I wasn't expecting it to be so close and so tight. Privacy, they had to push this hard point, it was the last one and they were going to win it on this if they didn't get in and they were so spawning so far out, Alice and the team couldn't get involved and it's a very close, 250 to 212 matchup there. Very close game. Ah, oh, Breezy's MVP of that match, so 33 and 23, what a fantastic Fantastic way to do it there. Oh, let's look at his board now. Let's go. So, first map is done. The score is in 22-12 in favour of Blaze Norway. At 250 to 212, sorry, I'm afraid, to... Uh, Blaze Norway, it was a fantastic matchup. That was was a lot faster than I expected. And now we're going to wait for the next lobby. Which will be starting up very soon. Next matchup, we're going to have an SND here. Slower pace, place game mode, thankfully. SND on Invasion. Lots of good spots in here. Good hiding, hiding spots for, uh, for SND. For some great god nades that can be pulled off as well. And some, some cheeky little... Uh, spots. I think this is the only the third match uh, map that uh, AK Nation have actually lost, which is uh, which is pretty good, pretty good going. But uh, sadly, their map record percentage will will drop a little bit after that one. But we'll we'll see how it goes for the rest of these matches. It might push back up if they go on to win the rest of them. <laughs> Carlos is used to getting beamed when rushing. Yeah, I get a bit. Okay, so we're going to try and change the colour scheme a little bit earlier because I think it was a little bit more difficult to see. We'll, we'll use uh, visuals. Let's go. Colours. Team identity. So. Swap team settings. Team one settings. I'm going to put AK Nation as white. Okay. I'll put them as like a, a white with a secondary colour red. There we go. That will make it easier. And hopefully that makes the view in, in a little bit smoother for you all as well. Let's look at the scoreboard here as well. There we go. Scoreboard 0 1 in favour of Blaze Norway. Let's make sure the chat know that I'm ready to go. Ready to go. Map two. Here we come. S and D. Coming up for our second matchup. We're on invasion. Let's get underway.
straight down the middle for privacy there, looking to see a couple of shots for the puck passing. They do spot a couple of players spot passing by. He sees, we can see Suman Desire, he hits him with a nade there, so that's a little bit of damage there, but privacy is spotted. Has to watch what he's doing, 21 HP there, trying to get out with his life there, does manage to find a different position. We've got Desire in it is, he's looking for the spots. Three players all moved over here for AK Nation. Now they're looking for the positioning. Oh, he spots privacy. Oh, he doesn't get the kill off him though there. Still, they have the advantage. Two, three men down. Brazies is the last man alive. And Brazies beams desire there though. Let's watch Brazies' point of view here as they try to compete here. 3v1. Bomb down at A. Brazies now knows it's there. He's going to look for the spot. Kills Callas. What a shot on Callas. Now he's going to look for the spawner, the player in the back. Suma is going to spot him though. Oh, he does. Suma spots him and there we go. Almost pulls off. The 3v1 clutch, but had to been something. A couple of kills there. Would have been godly, but sadly, it doesn't go in their favour. AK Nation 1 0 up. Some good shooting there. Good shooting. Okay, here we are. Now, let's look at Desire. Where is he spawning? He's looking down B lane. They're looking through tanks and stuff to see. The rotation for Breezy is coming around. Straight down, looking at that spot. Does spot Desire in the distance there. Breezy is holding it off there. Oh, there is one getting shot through dark there, but doesn't manage to pick up a kill here. Breezy is still looking for the stun down there. Looking for B spawn. Looking for any posi positions to get in there. Desire taking shots, so shooting at Breezy. Takes him down to 91 HP, though. Nice nade comes in, down to 7 HP, there's nobody there to trade it off though, number 4 knows there, Suma's sending that nade in there as well, comes from the corner, tries to beam, but Raz has picked up Sveps, then Desire picks up Privacy, it is now a 2v4, Suma, Raz going around the back here, spots Marfi in there, is he going to be able to find that? Here's the gunshots, challenge on tank, Marfi with the kills, a double kill from Marfi, 2v2. Close as it stands, you've got Breezy's miles away, facing against each other here. Bomb versus bomb carrier versus Desire, who's been down that B lane waiting this whole time. Are they going to get the the grenade off? Oh, the Breezy's is swept off, and then before you know it, his teammate is shot off. That makes it another point in favour of AK Nation. AK Nation two up, and this S and D's looking like a good S and D. For them so far, Marfian almost, almost with the god tears turn, but does get beamed. A couple of great headshots there to finish the kill there on that one. Okay, AK Nation with the bomb. Where is their plan to go from here then? Let's have a look. Two go down mid, one goes down left B side, one goes down... Oh, one, seven is in the back. Breezy's in the back, still waiting. Don't know what's happening with Breezy's. They've got a fine push up here. That B bomb. Oh, he's beamed off of it. Privacy is beamed off. Desire is traded out. Callus now looking for the players around from Blaze Norway. Where is, are they going? Need to look at where they're going. It is what's 3v3 still, so we are still pretty tied up here as it stands. Couple of shots going off in the distance there. That'll be number four. Suma in the distance. They're going to A bot plant bomb. See what they can do. They clear out A bomb here. Callas checking over the top. Finds it. Spotted though. Privacy spots. Beams Callas. Raz now on the bomb. Gets the smoke. Gets out of his life. But then in the corner, he is picked off from Brazies. Who was sitting back for so long? Suma is the last one alive for AK Nation. Is this a round going in favour of Blaze Norway? It is 2v1 here. Breezy's, oh, Breezy's hits the deck, gets the kills. Seth will get an ace. <laughs> I'm not a big fan of SD if I'm honest. But there you go. One round in favour of Blaze Norway. Is this them getting back into the swing of things? Breezy's on a 4 and 2 as it stands. It makes it 2-1 in the match. 
Let's look at Blaze Norway's startup. Where are they going? What is their plan from here? There we go, Marfin. Oh, cutting through rugs. Straight through. Going straight towards a bomb site. Slides in there. Gets killed, but trades it out there. 3v2. In favour of Blaze Norway. Callus looking over the point of a bomb slide. Oh, the Marfin's going to stun himself. Oh, this the sun goes through the other room, but the a bomb is planted. Nades come in, not hitting. Callus is the one that you want to watch here. He's in a great position, but he is the only person, a man alive in his side. Is he going to go to spot anybody? Perhaps he's just toying with him. Breezy's and teammate will just sit there waiting on a bomb site because there is nothing they're going to have to do for v one. It's a very difficult task here for Callus, but will he be able to pull it off? Privacy beaming through the tank area. Head glitch. Callus, 17 seconds left. Can he pull something off here? Breezies, he does get Breezies, but then he has traded out with his teammate. Perfect position for his teammate to trade that one out straight away. And that ties the game. Blaze Norway 2, AK Nation 2. Good, good trade there from Marfin. Very well did. Very well positioned to be able to trade out for... Okay, so here we go. Desire, we are watching. I don't know what it is with the stats in S&D because they just never ever seem to work right. So these stats now, it looks like people are donating, but they're really not. Sadly, guys, the stats do not show you the real stats uh, every single time. Sweps. Oh, he gets a couple of shots off on Sweps. Breezy's still looking over as well, but Kalas gets a couple of shots on him as well. Let's look at the bomb carrier. Braz is going down Beeb side. Privacy to the right-hand side. Does look... Like number four, yeah, Suma is coming up against two players here, and he does. Sweps picks up that kill there. Number six. In a good position. I don't know what he's picking up the bomb, is he? What was he doing? Picking up a weapon? Yeah, he's picking up the weapon. Desire. Closing out here. Kalas gets picked off here. It's 2v4. As it stands here, Raz is going to have a difficult situation here. Trying to peek here for the B bomb. Does he spot that? He doesn't spot the player running out there. Sweps runs out. It is now 4v1. Raz in a difficult position here. Has the bomb. Spots Privacy, but Privacy turns and burns. That's a great kill from Privacy there. I don't think he deserves to turn around like that quickly and snap right on there. Watch Privacy here. It probably doesn't look like a snap. Oh, it's definitely not, but it looked like a turn and snap. But yeah. He was pretty much in that position. Very well positioned there from Privacy to get the gunny. And that makes them take the lead there. Three maps in a row for Belize Norway. And they are leading. Let's give it a, let's jump onto Breezy's here. Breezy's been doing a grand old job here. The very start runs with the center looking through the tank, looking for the cross. Two minutes at that back head glitch up there. He's got a couple of good shots here. Breezy's doesn't get any kill there, but does weaken him down to give him a push down the center right hand side here. Marvin Ball car uh, bomb carrier going a clever way here. Keeping himself out of sight. Sweats, Breezy's. Still in the back, Breezy's, but they're going straight to B. Desire is watching over like a hawk. Sends the nade in. A perfect nade. Hits 32 damage, though. Stuns him on the, the ball as the bomb is being planted. There's a couple players here, though, to support that. They're all looking in the same direction. Managed to get out with his life marathon as well. And it's all three players here from Blaze Norway. Picked up one of them. Breezy's picks up Raz. Suma is on the head glitch at the tank here. Is he going to beam? He does. He beams privacy. Marfin's still trying to watch it. Nades stuns. Smoke's coming in and he's picked off. Guess it's going to be a retake here. Callus all over the place. The smoke can't see the players. Slides in through. But that is it. Sveps picks up that kill there. And the next one goes down straight afterwards. Blaze Norway takes it 4 2. Blaze Norway looking hot. They've managed to get into the swing of things on this SD now. They're back in. To it. That's a good shot from Breezy's on Desire, who was trying to help out his teammate Kalas, who pushed up in through the smoke. Sadly, couldn't trade anything out there, and both fall within a matter of seconds of each other. Okay, we're on board. We're going to jump on to Suma. Suma. We'll jump on Suma for this start up here, see where they tend to go. Suma number four is going down the left side here of the map, looking to go towards a bomb site, running through rugs. 
gets in a position here. Remember the last time they ran through here, they were traded out really, really quickly. There is somebody sitting in a waiting, and that is Sveps. Sveps is finishing. There's trade off. Double trade there. Kalas and Suma getting the kills there. It's now made it a 3v2. Desire does get traded out there from Breezy, so not long afterwards now. Suma doesn't know where to go. 2v2. Couple of players are quite far away though. Breezy's in privacy, looking to get this retake here. Privacy straight down. Oh, he gets beam from Suma. Absolute melt of the shots there from Suma. Perfect positioning. Breezy's the last man to come in, and he is beamed as well. Suma picks up the two piece here to end the round. AK Nation pick up the win to take, make the game a 3v4. This is getting close. It's hard to tell who is going to run away with this one. It's, it's not a runaway game, that's for sure. It could well go down to this final matchup. In the S&D, will this go to a 5-5 five, five, round 6? There is a potential to that, for sure. Okay, let's look on board. We're going to watch Privacy from the start here this time round. Privacy says he's 5-3. and three. Not sure if that's correct. Seb's definitely not 0-1 and one. There's definitely not 0-1. and one. Couple of shots here going 8 in Privacy. Who are watching this one all the way down B Street, managing to get clear sight, but number 3... Raz and that going down the center map. Privacy should should probably just have cleared B, B lane. I don't know if that's the plan. Or they have spotted and they're being told to go there. Does they are still watching that lane though, straight down there? The whole team rotated round towards A. This is gonna be a gunfight here, Marfin. Great timing for Marfin to turn and burn there as Raz comes through the doorway. It is first blood in favour of Blaze Norway. He pick up the second as well. Suma is picked off there from Privacy. Kalas has been spotted in the distance. Marvin sends a nade over. Don't think that's going to get the kill on him. Does know where he is though. Gives him some good information. Bomb goes down at A. Now, 4v1. Kalas is the last man alive. Let's see what Kalas can do. If he can get this retake here. Very unlikely. There's just four players. It will be traded out. Privacy has spotted him. Now they know where Kalas is. It's going to be a straight up push. There comes Brazy. Brazy comes running around the corner. And takes him out of the match. Blaze Norway are up five points to three. This could be the decider around here in the S and D. Okay, we'll jump on board a Kalas here, he'll go straight on tenor tank here, looking for the spots. Sees a couple of boys, there's smoke coming in though. Locks off the pass, but Sveps gets picked off from Raz. Let's look at Raz, who is the bomb cutter. Picks off one, people will know where he is, Breezy's is watching that doorway, just in case Raz decides to go through that doorway. But Raz isn't going to be silly about that privacy, here's that door for sure, and Breezy's goes out and trades it out. Knowing where he is, good information there. Passed on, Breezy's. Spots Callas will get out with their life though, 91 HP. Knows that Callas was in around about that vicinity, but there will be players coming around to rotate them. The bomb carrier Suma is still round the back here as well, sending out nades. Spotted by Privacy. Privacy gets the kill on Suma. That is two down now for the attacking side. Bomb carrier is down. Now we're going to have to look on Callas, see what they're going to do. They start to beam Breezy's, but Breezy's get ducks behind the cover. Perfect position is traded out though by Marfian, who then is now made it a 3v1 and he picks up the final kill there. Good couple of kills there. Blaze Norway take the win. 6 3 in the SND. That's two maps down now for AK Nation. There's a final kill that Marfian comes sliding around. Desire's trying to get the kill as he gets shot in the back with the rival 9. 6 3. In favour of Blaze Norway. Blaze's 12 and 4 though. Perfect, perfect match up there. Blaze Norway leading the way, the way in the series.
visual team identity blaze normal should be top Two zero in favor of Blaze Norway. Marky B is now homeless. I'm gonna be homeless. The wife's gonna kick me out as well, mate. The little man he's deciding he's not one to settle. At quarter past eight, sad times. Normally well asleep by now. He has been ill for the last few days though, so I mean, it's probably not helping him. Okay, looking at the series, as it stands, this could go in favour of Blaze Norway, a 3 in 0 if they win this Invasion Control. Invasion Control, very difficult map though. AK Nation did get themselves into the swing of the match up in the SD at one point. It looked like they were starting a good lead, 2 0 up, come back down, and before you know it, Blaze Norway is heading ahead of the lead. Very close matchup, so very both. Very strong sides, both looking very good. Gunnies are on point. It's just about who gets there and gets the kills at the crucial times here. Come on, please. <laughs> oh, I need to tell them I'm ready, don't I? Caster is ready. We are good to go. Got that. Thank you very, very much, young Leo the plug. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. Welcome. Welcome to Team G. Very welcome. So just waiting on the next matchup to start up. What do you lads think that uh, Blaze Norway have this map in the bag as well? Invasion, followed by Invasion. They just won their Invasion SND. Now, feels like I'm watching Scotland v Germany again. <laughs> ah, it wasn't that bad of a pumping. The Scotland game was horrendous. Great start to this, the, the Euros, just as you could imagined. After the, most of the Scottish nation going, I think we've got a good chance here against Germany. Let's go. Here we go. We're heading in to Invasion Control. This could potentially be the last match up here on this series. If AK Nation don't win this one, they are beaten by Blaze Norway. So let's have a look to see where we stand. You're calling it 3-0. There we go. The other plug's calling it 3-0. We'll have to wait and see, won't we? We'll have to wait and see. Blaze Norway run. Swept, swept. Looking towards B lane. Marvin comes through the centre. So does Privacy. On top of the tank. Looking for the spot. They're going straight towards A. But Sweps is going to watch the background here. Let's look at Sweps here. Oh, Marvin gets killed off of the point. Callus and that all looking down the side here for D. Looking good though. Privacy on the point is beamed off of it. Sweps now having to come back here and clean it up here. Oh, a couple of good kills in favour of AK Nation now. Let's look over at Desire. Spot on over. Oh, he's picked off just as we go on top of it. Breezy's on the point now. Capturing zone B. We're at the second tick here as it stands. A lot of AK Nation. Nowhere to be seen. Nowhere near the B side. They are all around the A side. A side is the most difficult one to to take, which makes sense to defend it for the most part. Now, Brazy's picked it up. There we go. We're now rotating around the back of the map here, number six. 
from Carlos. We'll be watching the back flank here. Trevisy comes out, is beamed. Carlos just got beamed off of that glitch there from Privacy with a nice slide in. Privacy gains the head high ground. Carlos looking to get back up the high ground. Is spotted here. Does manage to get in and duck down. But Privacy sends a nade over, hits the nade, and that is perfect for Privacy. Two down in the feed as the rotation around the back comes. Privacy looking to get in the back. Once you get around the back here, get their spawns in a position where they can't spawn there. You are in a good position. There we go. Carlos is watching the back. Sveps is coming on the back here as well. Raz has picked up. He spots Desire. Is he going to get on the point? He knows the players aren't on the point. Now it's going to be two on the point if Marfian jumps in here as well. Marfian is not on the point, but Marfian... Where does he go? Marfin should jump on the point for extra time. No, Marfin does it. Marfin's trying to find it, but Suma is coming in. Desire beaming Sveps. Oh, and falls up by Breezy's knowing that the players are going to be coming off a spawn now. Here we go. Desire in a perfect position. Watching Dark. Spots Dark. Headshots there for Desire. Now he's in a perfect position here to try and get Sveps. Sveps picks him up. Now look at Carlos. Where is Carlos looking? He is looking a little across here. Is he going to spot Breezy's? He spots Breezy's. Can't get the shots off as the duck down behind the cover, but it's picked up by Privacy. Good guns from Privacy, though. It's 15 and 16. Almost, yeah, it's pretty e it's even on lives remaining now. There we go. We're one and a half ticks of A, but A has been ticked now. Marfi, and there's two of them on the point. They are on the point. Callus is going to have to get in there. Is he going to get in there? He gets picked up from Privacy. Sveps. Oh, Raz gets the kill. Is traded out there. Double kill, and there we go. Blaze Norway. Take the point. It went so quickly because two players were on the point. A perfect positioning, a perfect rotate around, and that double kill there is the final kills from Sweeps before the finisher. That is a fantastic take. That's how you do the attack on this map up matchup. It's a very difficult matchup, I feel as well. Okay, AK Nation looking to be the ones going towards the point. We'll watch plays. Now, Privacy, who has been beaming. Most kills goes to Desire, though. Desire did do some great shots earlier. A um, couple of doubles there. We've got two down in the feed now, followed by two down in the feed for... Oh, three down in the feed now for Blaze Norway as they get the kills on the defenders. Blaze Norway trying to defend this one. This is There you go, finds Callus around the corner. And there we go. A couple of trophy systems. We're just going to knock them off, Privacy. Couple of kills in favour of AK Nation now as they get onto the B point. The B point is going to be double stacked. Privacy coming around to try and stop it here for a second. Is spotted here from the des Desire. But Privacy gets out. Oh, Suma gets a team kill there with the nade. That's unfortunate. Wow, good position there from Desire to get uh, the kill there on Privacy. But is a double there in favour of Blaze as they take back the point. And start to stop that B cap here. Sweps got onto the tank here. Good nade here from Desire. Will they find a position to get Sweps here? Sweps tries to get out of his life. He does manage to get out. Let's see where Sweps is heading. Oh, he's got the beam. He gets the beam on Desire. Callus coming around the corner now. Sweps knows there's another there. Sweps is weak though. He is trying to be challenged here, but Callus gave up the, the shot there and wasn't getting on a position there. Akination have to move here. Plays Norway pushing off the point here. It's a perfect defend here. As they defend this point with the whole lives, everybody's just just firing at all cylinders. There we go, good kill there from Callus and Suma, but they have to come on to that point there now. Let's look at Suma, gets onto the point, are they going to stop the cap? Yes they do, Callus is both on, they're going to get the B point with the last 12 seconds remaining. Breezy comes through the dark, he picks up one kill, but the point is secured. Now we're looking to get a, here we go, Marfian. Lives in favour of Blazo, seven more lives available in the tank. Marfian going on the flank here, looking for the defenders, looking for the attackers, sorry, here we go. Suma spots him though, Suma gets the kill. Suma and AK Nation having to watch their lives here. A couple of lives going in their favour though, they find a few more. They'll even this out here, one does die though, Revs. Sveps is killed by Raz, or the other way around, sorry. Marfian, oh, a couple of good shots here, is traded out there. Suma gets the kill on that one. Breezy's double piece, kills Desire, Suma, seven players left. For AK Nation, all their hopes are on this one. Desire, are they going to spot any players in the rotation here? Oh, he doesn't. He's getting shot out in the back. There's only five players left. Sveps 
says Raz. A is being capped. There is only one on A. Blazes goes to challenge that. Suma's there as well, just on the corner. Doesn't see, not, isn't spotted by Swept. Swept's got away his life though. But they do know he's there. Seven seconds left. Couple of players dead. Privacy with a double. And that's it. They can't get in there. There's only one life alone main and that's Raz. That's a great position here. For Blaze, Norway. 2-0 um, up. In the control. Could be a swift 3-0 here. Look at that double there. Callus and Desire both shot out from privacy. 13 and 7 for this control. They go to match point here. Can they win the series here with a 3 0 swift control? Privacy showing up with a 13 and 7. Both on a streak though. Swept and Privacy. The team of AK Nation only one going positive. Callus gone technically positive, but evens. Marking, looking for the shots here. Trying to spot Suma Suma, he's got ducked on behind cover there though. Desire coming to trade that back out here as well if he can, but he is taken down to 34 HP. Doesn't manage to get there. Callus is on the point here. Let's see where Sweps is going. They're going away round to the B side. Whole team straight around B. There we go. Are they going to just triple cap this? Are they going to... No, oh, Brazies is picked off there from Desire. Marfian kills Suma. Raz is picked off from Sweps. Great positioning. As he comes around the corner, just in a kind of a glitchy area that you can't really see. Couple of kills in favour of Blaze Norway now though. Ticking and ticking and ticking and privacy. We're going to watch privacy because that was just freaking me out. Suma. Oh, I beamed. Ball traded out there and there you go, Desire. There's a couple of players down now in the, new, in the feed here. Going in favour for the rotation of Blaze Norway, taking their time to go down the flank here. Both of them team players stunned though, they have to get out with their lives here if they can. Suma trying to come down behind them. Let's look at Suma, see if he's going to spot them, he's gone up high. Is he going to spot the players up left? He did, he spotted Marvin. Marvin manages to survive it, he's going to get traded out here, he gets one. So, Suma with the double, how does he survive that there? Great couple of kills there for Suma, privacy. Beamed off of it. Blaze is lying down in a position, gets shot by the Lunetti. Suma's on a streak there, but that has just been ended there by Sveps. Very well did there. Teams in favour of uh, AK Nation here. 21 and 17 lives, though. They still need to get this A point. Let's look at Sveps. Where is he positioned here? Breezy's going through dark. Is spotted by Raz. Raz picks him up. Then Desire picks up Privacy. Marvin picks up Kalas, though, to take it back in. Raz is beamed by Sveps. Now they're trying to find the positions here to get forward towards the A push. Desire has been... Heard in the back there from Sveps as he killed a teammate. Desire's just trying to... He's, I think he's beating. He's, Desire's just beating for this kill here. Oh, he does get it as well. Desire throws a nade over. Oh, that's a nade. It's perfect nade from Privacy. As he gets the kill. Does Privacy slow down a little bit. Just a little bit. Oh, he's stunned, but he still gets the kill on Raz. That's unfortunate for Raz. Let's look at positioning here. Eight lives left for Blaze Norway. They need to watch what they're doing here. They, they, they need to try and get some kills here on the board, but AK Nation are not having it, and they are rolling. Oh, another couple of kills there. Desire. Coming back into this. Suma, let's have a look at Suma. Suma gets one. Only 11 seconds left. Only four players left for Blaze Norway. It looks like this one's going to be a win for AK Nation. They're not getting the donut against them. Thank God for that. Oh, what a match. What match is this turning into be? Is this going to be a reverse sweep on the control here for AK Nation? They ping the bat map back. 2-1 in favour of Blaze Norway. Good couple of kills there. Desire brings it back to evens for their score. KD, 17-17, Callas, 10-10. There you go, they, that one brought most of their players back into the positive KD here. Now we'll watch on board with Suma here. Nobody's really on a streak here, actually. Raz is on a streak. Raz is on 7-12, and 12, though, but he's on a free streak. Let's see where Raz goes. Raz is beamed straight away. Free piece in for Blaze Norway, and there goes the fourth one. Suma is picked off. Suma was managed to grab one. Sadly, didn't get in the position there. Let's look at... Uh, Look at Brazy's. Where's Brazy's positioned here? Oh, Brazy's just goes down. Privacy. 
looking for the flank, looking for a player in the back, sees Desire, is beamed off by Desire, Desire is looking towards A on his own, if Desire gets on there, that is going to be a free cap here, because most of the players are defending here, over at B, Breezy's is there though, can he grab the pint, I don't think he will, he's two players pushing in, he kills Breezy though, and gets away his life for a second, but doesn't manage to fully cap it, B is being capped though in the meantime, so that's a great distraction, Callis and Raz, double piecing up here, is Raz going to fall too, that's a double, Marfian kills them both off of the point to stop the progress. Two ticks done though. Third tick going now. Desire there. Marfian's looking for it again. And he. Ah, there we go. Marfian picks the kill up again. Marfian's having to get back from uh, the KD. So let's see how they do here. They're on a free streak here. One's been beamed off. Suma just got killed from privacy. One player gets out with their life though. Marfian still trying to hold off this B push. It is so close. So close for Aiken Nation, but it doesn't look like they're going to get on this point. Marfian is killed off at those steps. This is the closest one there. I gets the beam around it. Are they going to get B? Privacy is coming for Dark. Straight for Dark. Does get the kill though, Privacy. Privacy in a position to go back out. B does get secured and they're going to have to quickly rotate around to A. We've only got a minute and 20 seconds left. But the lives are in favour of Blaze Norway as it stands. Marfian looking for the cross at Dark. Suma is there in the right hand side. He knows it. Just waiting for them. Looks like Suma comes, but Suma gets the kill. Right, let's look at the defenders here. Number four. Brazies spots Suma in the cross. Didn't spot Raz there, but he was in through towards the A-bomb site. Oh, on his left-hand side, he sees it, but Raz is there to kill the player very quickly off the head. Breezy's lying down and gets oh, that's privacy. Privacy beaming. But does get shot off. Kalas gets onto the point here now. Now it's capturing A. Gets the trophy system out. He's looking the wrong way. Cod time at his best here. Yeah. Gets the kills. Oh, there we go. A couple of kills in the feed goes their favour though. They just need to get privacy. Privacy just got a double desire and summer. Kalas is pre firing and gets the kill on him. Jumps off the point though. Should contest it. Does get the first tick. No, he doesn't. Sveps gets the kill. Stops that tick. And it's an 8v8. It's almost like an S and D at this point now. Twenty six seconds left. The whole of A point needs to be cut recapped again. So it's got it very dead on the point. It looks like it's going to be a very difficult position here for AK Nation to come back from this. Players rotating on the back. They're far too far out here, though. Far too far out, and they're not getting the kills here. There you go. Desire Raz both fall down to three men alive. Alive. Martin trades it out though. Callus is beamed off of it. There's only two players alive. This is the map win for Blaze Norway. 3 and 1 goes in favour of Blaze Norway. What a matchup. Top two teams in the league in Group B here for Division 6. And you can see why. Fantastic effort for both sides. Unlucky AK Nation, but your winners of this evening with a 3 0 goes in favour of Blaze Norway. Great matchup. MVPs across the board here. Sveps 22 and 20. I don't think these are all the real stats, but very, very strong effort from that side of Blaze Norway. Marvian, Sveps, Privacy and Breezy's GG, Desire, Raz, Suma and Kalas. Unlucky. Hopefully you guys can get a wee bounce back game at some point and get yourself back into it. I went to say GG. GG to them in chat as well there. So, our third map, it's a 3 0. It's a 6. What was it? 3 1. In favour of Blaze Norway. Which makes the scoreboard a 3 0 for Blaze Norway. For oh, fuck's sake, until you tell them they need to pick me up. <laughs> GG's guys, fantastic effort tonight for both teams. Unlucky AK Nation, a 3 0 doesn't merit the score lines. Very close matchups, every single map. Um, very well done for both of you. Hope you've enjoyed. Guys, I hope you've very, very much enjoyed the stream. Everything went smoothly this time, and hopefully the positioning and the calls were fine. We're, we're getting our second cast ever doing this. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to doing more. And uh, if you guys are needing casters, just uh, hit me up.
just make sure you send them DMs when there's a games match and I'll see if I can do it. And if I can, I will be there. We really do appreciate it, guys, for jumping in. Thank you for the guys that have followed as well. Uh, and really enjoy the rest of your evening, whatever you choose to do. Uh, double Pace catches on the flip side.